Well, I promised Mama I'd pick some oranges today, <clears throat> and sure enough, I did. But before I went about that, I took and made some pictures of our little orange tree, just to have it and see if I could mess around with it, make some of the pictures a little bit on the better side. So I, first I took a picture of the tree just as it was with my old camera backed off a little bit and said, well, maybe I better make a panorama of this thing in the vertical sense and make a little picture here and then click it up a little, you know, a little higher and, you know, let the picture overlap. And uh, so I went ahead and I made, oh, let's say about, I think, five pictures that way one after the other and uh, you know it uh, it worked out pretty good and then I ran them through some software that makes a, what they call a composite an image of, of, of the tree uh, by stitching all those single pieces together one after the other and when I got to Picture number seven, I think it was. Yes, picture number seven. Uh, I knocked it off and said, well, I'm going to make my panoramic image of this thing, which I did, and uh, then enhanced it a little bit, made the colors somewhat on the brighter side. Because today was a kind of a cloudy day, kind of a miserable cloudy day. We're supposed to have big storms tonight and tomorrow and all that. So anyway, it was a good day to get the oranges in uh, before the big rain hit and all that. And um, after I got all my little pictures done of the tree itself, I said, well, maybe I better take some pictures of some of the oranges that are hanging on the tree. But I got to watch myself because that doggone tree has stickers about oh, some of them almost two inches long and if you reach out and grab something on that tree you might be in for a big surprise so anyway I looked and there was some oranges hanging within reach and I looked at one of them from the top on down and I said well that'd make a pretty good picture so I uh, aimed the camera at it and said, snap oh And there it went. I got me a picture of this orange hanging on to the branch for dear life. I think it was scared I was going to pick it, which I probably did. I'm not sure if that was one of them, but more than likely. And then there was one a little bit over my head. So I said, oh, I'll take a picture of that one. And there was just a little bit more light up there. so. Bang oh, I got that picture, and uh, there you see it. It's a pretty good little old picture, and uh, well, you know, just one one orange, that's not enough. So I looked around, there's a couple of them hanging close together like they were buddies, and I said, ooh, give me that one. And there was some behind them too, and so that made a nice old picture, hiding in the middle of that sticky old sticker bush called an orange tree and anyway then I managed to pick a bunch of them and put them in this little container and made a picture of the whole bunch of them all together just to show off that man I, I'm a pretty good orange picker aren't I and while I was hanging around out there doing all this good stuff I looked next to the orange tree and I had forgotten my wife had a little lemon tree there little bush, not a very tall thing, and there was some lemons on it. So, well, I'll make a picture of that doggone lemon. And there it is. This thing looks more bigger than an orange than an orange does. Anyway, enough for the day. I had my oranges. See you next year, as the saying goes. <laughs>